this is every entrepreneur's nightmare. <laughs> to have a partnership gone awry, to have investor relationships that go bad, it happened to Facebook. It happened to Apple when Steve Jobs left the company. It happened to Tory. So what advice can you give to entrepreneurs in the audience or entrepreneurs-to-be who have to think about who do I partnership, who do, who do I partner with, and how many, how many investors do I want to give in, get, bring into the company and how much do I give away? Yeah, no, I mean, I think that's a great, very good question. One thing I see all the time with entrepreneurs is that they give too much of their company away way too soon. And that's something that I think um, needs to be really thought about and, and who you bring in. And, and we are so lucky to have met the partners that we recently just brought in. But I will say it was not a just met situation. We really spent a lot of time getting to know Bill Ford and Byron Trott. And um, feel, not only will they add tremendous value to our company, but they share our vision. And, and really, it is about having a common vision about where you see the company going. We're a very patient brand. Despite this growth we've had, it's been very strategic and thought out. And we always, in every decision we make, think about how is it going to affect the company five, 10 years from now. And it really is about, I, I laugh with a friend of mine, Leonardo Ferragamo, whose mother is Wanda Ferragamo. She still is coming into the office at 85. And I said, you know, I want to be your mom. I mean, I don't ever not see working. So you don't want to put yourself in a position where you have to leave your company. And, and I have seen that. I've seen it with great friends. And it's a very sad thing. So a lot of investors have wanted to put money into this private company, Tory Burch, which is now valued at over $2.5 billion. Uh, and you spent about a year deciding who you wanted to bring in as an investor. Um, can you tell us anything about that process? Can you tell us what kind of questions you ask to potential investors and what what were the most important questions that they asked you? Well, they got to know our business um, through, through many different venues, through actually just people they knew, through consulting companies. Um, but I think the most important aspect of it all is instinct and just seeing if there is a synergy and, and integrity. And, and both of the people that you just mentioned have extremely high integrity, and that's the most important thing to me. And also, you see um, how they treat people. And I, one of the most important parts of our company is the culture. And that is something that um, we want to protect in an enormous way. We don't want to bring someone in that will in any way change the culture that we've worked so hard to build.